Well, hot temperatures now blanket the state of California. Cal ISO now issuing a flex alert. That's tomorrow evening. Thanks for joining us tonight here on the CW at 10. I'm Veronica Macias. And under this extreme heat here, people are being reminded that they want to conserve as much power and energy as possible so we don't have power interruptions. And for that reason, again, everyone being asked to do their part. KIO and Stephanie Aceves is live for us tonight with those hours on this flex alert and what you should be doing tomorrow as you arrive home from work. Veronica, this flex alert is scheduled for tomorrow between 5 to 10 p.m. Tomorrow, Californians need to be considerate and mindful of their energy energy use because if they are not, they can overwhelm the state's power grid and no one wants that. Flex alerts are typically issued during the summer under extreme heat because there is usually more demand for electricity during these hot months. California's current heat advisory is causing and draining the state's energy power. California residents are encouraged to conserve energy to lessen the demand and prevent blackouts. One resident in Salinas tells me energy conservation involves the entire community. It's, it's important for for everybody. We all don't pay attention and we don't cut down on our power. I mean, it's, it's we're being selfish. It's not going to be fair to everybody else who's going to be in certain areas without any power. And People need to avoid major appliances starting at 3 p.m., set home thermostats at 78 degrees, and turn off unnecessary lights and use fans for cooling. The California ISO, the institution responsible for managing the flow of electricity of power lines, says that statewide call to conserve is critical because when a wide geographic area hits high temperatures like we're experiencing again, there might not be enough energy. Veronica, back to you. Thank you, Stephanie. Let's be mindful. Consider it tomorrow. And in Soledad, some relief for people. The city now opening a community center that's on Walker Drive. This is for you to beat the heat. Families here with children, they're also going to be giving away free popsicles if you're interested and need to stay cool. And a reminder, if you have any pets, very important here to make sure that those paws are protected. Pet owners here reminded not to walk their dogs during the peak of the heat because of the hot pavement. If it's too hot for your barefoot. Same goes for the dog. Also a reminder to never leave children or pets in a hot car during these temperatures.